welcome to the SPL Wrap. I'm Catherine Robert to take you through what caught our attention from this weekend's round of matches. Lion City Sailors are up against Brunei DPMM back in Singapore football after an absence of three years brought about, of course, by the COVID-19 pandemic. Brunei DPMM made a welcome return to the SPL after a three-year hiatus and were greeted with a warm welcome by LCS's Maxime Lestian and Kodai Tanaka. Lestian! Just before half-time, Lion City Sailors get their goal. Easy one there for Tanaka. He won't have an easier one. The pair combining for a total of four goals and three assists from their two matches. Hunting in pairs continued to be the theme of the weekend. This time it was Japanese Rovers Faris Romley and Boris Kapitovic. And we have our opening goal, Faris Romley scored against Kelang International. Last time out, he's on the score sheet once again. Faris, two and two. While last season's top scorer in the league looks back to his best. And there you go, Kapitovic off the mark in this season's SPL. His first of the campaign. The young Lions still in search of their first point this season went down 3-1 to Ballastia Khalsa. They were at the receiving end of an early contender for assist of the season. Wow, just wow, I'm in absolute awe. The vision to see that pass and to execute, the technical quality to execute, just beautiful from Taniguchi. That's got to be right up there. I know it's early days in the campaign, but that's already one of the early nominees for assist of the season. Assist season. Oh, we've got some competition. Maxime Lestien as well here on this pitch. The Young Lions have now conceded 10 goals in three games. And the final match of the weekend saw Geelang International continue their unbeaten run to the start of the season. They defeated Haogang 2-1 to go top of the table and got their season off to a flying start. Of course, got to take the shot. It's found its way in. The sheer power of the shot from Vansel Besko finds its way past Zaifel Lizam. And that could well be the winner for Geelang International. So those were the headlines from across the grounds this weekend. We picked out an early contender for assist of the season. Unfortunately, it's not an official award given out. But you can tell us if you think it should be included as one of the categories at the FAS Awards Night this year. Start typing in the comment section below and get the conversation going. Until next time, I'm Catherine Robert.